Hello everybody and welcome to part 2 of Spyro Enter the Dragonfly. This video is brought to you by MuchGames.ca and Machinima. So today we will actually be continuing on with the uh, story of the game. So uh, today, no, I do not have my new mic uh, because there's no time to pick it up today. So we'll have it tomorrow, so if you're still having that uh, left ear, right ear issue, then I'll have that fixed for you. So anyway, let's be going to the first actual level. Oof. What, really? You, you get stuck there? Okay, whatever. Which is Dragon Dojo, or at least I think it is. Yeah, look how glitchy that looks going up on that thing. Yay! We found 224 gems. It, what? What's the point of that? It doesn't even show it. Oh no, I think my game froze! Okay, no, it's fine. Yeah, this game will scare you a lot if you're not careful, or if you've never played this game before. Like, look at the load time. It's... Pretty long for a Spyro game, and this is the GameCube version. So the load times versus the PS2 version are cut down by half. Okay, so uh, what the Zoe? Oh no! Uh, looks like the rib talks are frozen. Wait a minute. There is something funny about this. Now, the thing is, is uh, Ripto is the enemy. Okay. Which is the Spyro 2 boss. He did not have anything like... Uh, uh, Riptox helping him. Which is really funny that they incorporate Riptox... Wait. Oh wait, never mind. Riptox. I was thinking Rhinox. Really? That's what they call Ripto's minions now are Riptox? Ah, oh, what a ripoff of Rhinox and Ripto, man. Couldn't come up with a better name that didn't sound like the other games. And wow, the Dragon Dojo is just like in the middle of the sky, and wow. Okay, looks like I need bubble breath. Because you know, bobble breath is the way to go. Hey, it's Steffi. Steffi, eh? Steffi. I cannot use bubble breath to defeat ninjas. Because, you know, lizard ninjas are, you know, epic creatures. I don't think we can get 100% in this level either, so do not expect 100% here. It's very rare that you're gonna ever get 100% in the first couple of levels right away. Because there's a lot of things we don't have. Like this one, I think is another instance of where we need, um, Ice Breath. And is that really? Oh, I thought it was in the water. And most people aren't gonna look in there. Uh, we've got the dragon here. We'll need Fire Breath to, uh, free him. But watch how laggy it is when you flame out. Like, look how slow the gem moves. Let's free this dragon. Ah, Spyro. Thank goodness you had the sense to free me from that icy cage. Who would have thought the Riptox would dare invade the sacred Dragonfly Dojo? Spyro, do what you can to return the Dojo to its peaceful state by freeing all of the Dragon Masters. Remember, Spyro, the way of the dragon is to be a dragon. Okay, so, um, I was wrong, it's Dragonfly Dojo. And, uh, yeah, so, you know, there's Rip Talks and Weirdness Galore. I don't really know what to think of this game. I, like I said, I have no clue why I'm playing it or why I decided to instead of playing Spyro 2. I think it's because I wanted to really just start off with something different. And, well, to do that, I had to choose a game that, you know, not a lot of people LP. A lot of beginning LPers play this, not a lot of, like, the ones that became pro really fast. Like, Chugga Conroy and stuff, with, like, randomly his, like, Earthbound and stuff like that became really popular, yet it was, like, garbage. No offense, like, he even says it's bad, though, like, he didn't even expect to stay in Let's Playing. He just wanted to play a game, and that was it. And then after that, it became popular, and people encouraged him to keep going. And why do I always do that? And he could have hit me, but he didn't. Ten gold. You're, I mean, ten gems. Gold gem that's worth ten points. I wish it was like Spiral 1, though, where the gem total was just the gems that you collected in this level. Oh, hey, I think that's the, these are the red gems I think I always miss. But I don't think... Maybe we can get 100% on the gems here, but I know we can't get all the dragonflies. Man, it's taking a long time just to go through this first little portion of the level. We've been here for quite a while. 
So I think it's about time we move on and, you know, kill some more ninjas. I love killing ninjas. I like the samurai more than I like ninjas, even though ninjas are really cool. I am a huge fan of Japanese uh, culture. I grew up, you know, playing Japanese games and stuff, and oh, what the frick is that thing? Oh, really? Why didn't I flame? Hmm. Hey, he looks pretty dumb, but he's also big and- Really? He's not big and fat, he was tall and skinny. Really, Sparks? You don't know what fat is. This is why the world is either too skinny or too fat, it's because of people like you, Sparks. You very judgmental little dragonfly. We took our first hit, but this is because these are the first enemies in the entire game. I'm used to playing Hero's Tale where the X button is to actually charge, not the flame. And really? Um, I didn't even jump and I pressed that button and it did that weird. See, this is an instant where that game is like really glitchy. It's still a fun game though. It can be frustrating because the way it moves. Mm, yes. You'll say she's a fairy zaps you. Yes, it's the same fairy though. It's always Zoe. Or like Dr. Henry Elzel says Zoe. Now, eat this ninja. Ninjago. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I'm, I'm honestly thinking I'm going to keep these videos like, you know, uh, around the 15 minute mark. Like I said, you guys actually enjoy videos like that. And, there you go. Come on, get over here, you little turd face. I hate hunting the. Oh, there we go, finally. Shellac. Hey, it's Shellac. Or, I guess, Shellac. Whatever. Shellac, a back a ding dong. What's with all the red gems? Does this game ever give you anything other than red gems? Like, there's very few other colored gems in here. Besides red and green. This is my favorite room, though, in the entire uh, area. Just because the way they designed it looks really cool. And you know what? I need some more help. Not like I'm gonna die anytime soon, unless I fall off a cliff, but... I don't need a grass over. And what's funny is the dragons here speak like they have a Japanese accent. Like, what is that? Dragons never lived in Japan in this game. I know Spyro had a Japanese game, which is really cool, and I'd actually like to see the difference between them. But... There was no Japanese dragons, man. Oh, hey, there's one of the little guys. These gems are really easy to miss, so be careful when you're going through that water. Oh, look, another big bully. Okay, I'd like to collect that gem, please. Thank you very much. And more gems, more gems. Is there a... Okay, I thought there was one here. Do I have to talk to every single one? Uh, thank you for releasing me. Wow, that's way too much to talk. I don't feel like talking to you when all you have to do for me is open the door. Because, you know, we since we have no hands, we can't open doors. We have to get magical dragons from Japan to open doors. Hmm. Yes. Hey, yeah, big fat bully. Wow, that took forever for that gem to drop. Oh yeah, I forgot this button's to look and to pound at the same time. That's funny when I thought like pressing B in the air would charge instead. Wow, the hover button's also the uh head bash button. That is like really bad button placement. I hate the fact that they use so many of the same button. Like so many commands on the same button, I mean. And ooh, looks like a challenge. It has sparks on it. What does this mean? Ah! We're going through some weird portal and found 282 treasure. We're at 506. So yes, I'll have another part of a uh, Yoshi up tonight. Do with Sonic and that. Actually, that's about it. Pokemon Crystal, like I said, will be a two thing a week. It'll replace, um, probably Sonic. Banzai Speedway is home to the most peaceful course in the East. Uh, yeah, sure, it's, it's just Speedway. Let, you know what, let's race the ninjas first. Max through, sure to, yes, we know. We've done these challenges on my, uh, previous Spiral Let's Play. Can we flame? 
Okay, anyways. Uh, oh, great. It's done like Spyro 3, which I have yet to play. But it's... You know, I don't know. I have no clue what to say. I have nothing to say about this. It's like the same thing, except for we're racing ninjas on hang gliders. There's nothing else to say. Like, seriously. There is nothing. Boring, boring, and boring. It's gonna take up most of the video right here. Hmm. What else to say? Forex Strangers is, you know, kind of at its standstill, so remember, guys, subscribe to him. Just type in the Forex Strangers. We have so many members, we're still looking for one more member, and what the F was that? Yes, yes, yes. Loading, please wait. Wow, I didn't even notice that I actually pressed it. The controls are just awful though for like the flying part here. Everything is like misleading and get out of the way, buddy. I have no time for stupid ninjas to get in my way. I need to win this race. For the better of mankind. I don't know if that's true. I don't think there's humans in this game. This is actually one of the only spiral games where there's not a humanoid creature. I can't believe I missed this ring though, like really? I think it was that one I missed. Or was it? I don't know. And there's three laps to this place. Holy cow. I don't, oh wow, we're already on second lap actually, and we're only fourth. Sometimes, like, you really gotta cut corners. And, oh hey, I didn't realize there was one there. But we're third. And, uh, yes, we have a little more to go. Let's see if we can at least, you know, get first. Well, we actually need to get first, otherwise we don't get the dragonfly. I think there's one more speedway in this game, at least I think. This isn't the only speedway, if I remember. But, once again, like I said in the previous episode, I've rarely actually played this game. So, yeah, I beat it once and that was it. I haven't played it since, and wow, we're... We're third? How are we third? Um, yeah, I'm third how? I just passed, like, everybody multiple times. What is this, man? Really? I'm gonna come in second? How does that happen? Really, game? Oh my god. How did... Did we get past somewhere? Yes, we have to try again. Hmm. Forgot about these challenges. These levels are actually longer than most Spyro games. Because of these challenges. But at the same time, it's like, wow, one level takes forever. And it gets really, really boring. But yet, it's like, you incorporate so many features into one level it's crazy because this isn't the only challenge here there's like one where I get to play as a vehicle I'm not gonna spoil it For those who have played it do not tell the other guys who have not played it yet what happens it's just rude and wow there's a missile there I didn't even notice that before but these guys does he have a shield on oh no the way he was like moving looked like he had a shield on oh yes this one too we're doing awesome! We're third still, which is weird. That was like third most of the uh, race last time. Oh, there's first place. Wait a minute. No, we keep passing the old places. Like, which one's first? How do you know who's first? Like, really? The, the last place guys go so slow. So, we might have almost won, or we might have almost... Or we might have lost big time in the last race. I don't actually know. Oh no, I'm assuming this guy who's taking all the same things as us is the guy that we need to, Yeah. The guy that we need to pass. Do they need to fly through all the rings or only us? I don't know. There's like extremely last place again. I should just like torch him just for the fun of a torch. Oh, I missed him. Yay, we're gonna win this. 
win is from Mother Russia. Yahoo! Victory is mine. I do not want to try again. Why does it even say that? Those ninjas were embarrassed after being whipped. What hey, the? It's your Jimbo. Yo Jimbo looks like Yo Jimbo. Yes, now we have the time attack. Easiest way is, you know, go in order, obviously. Because going in order is always the easy one, but never the fastest way. We have two minutes, though. Does that seem like a long time for a speedway? Is everything that spaced out? Like, honestly, man? It's the probably the eight ninjas of hang gliderness. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. I'm killing all of you. All you guys want to do is hang glide, and I'm killing you. Oh, great. Speed boosting like this, and what the frick are these guys? Little Chinese pigmen? Yeah, what the heck kind of enemy is this? Or, well, I guess not really enemies, they're just guys that we need to defeat to, you know, beat the level. And get a dragonfly so we can leave. There's the last one. Hey, thank you. I was wondering where you were. Okay, so now to get these. If I'm not mistaken. Whoa, 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 what the heck was that? Ugh, last time I fly into a lantern. You get stuck in the lantern, man. It's not hard, you just get stuck easily. My dog is having a bark attack. Because someone must have locked her up because uh, they wanted to go do something in town. And then now she barks at everything. And those rings, I don't even know why they're there. They're so close together. They don't even pose a, a little challenge. Some of these guys are like way too close together though. And then there's like some that are spaced out. It, it's almost frustrating how sometimes like you have to try and hopefully press the button in time because your flame is so delayed. Yeah. This guy's actually, he doesn't follow the road completely. He actually goes off to the side. I think you're actually going to get these guys without having to go inside. Okay, got him, and I heard Skype in my ear. So I'm wondering who that was. It was probably like board or something like that. He always talks to me in the evening. Okay, you know what? Let's try this again. Okay, so yes, we do have to torch him. We still have a minute to do this, really? Do these lanterns go all the way around the course? It doesn't really matter which way you go. I don't think it matters. You'll eventually go in a loop. Wow, this is actually a short course. Okay, no, I think the other ones are just over here. Hopefully 30 seconds is enough to do it. And really? There's an in-game wall there? What was that? Come on, game. Really? Holy cow, that was awful. See what I mean, guys? And there, we beat the level. Or beat the, um, speedway. Yay! Try again? No. I don't think you get gems for that either. <laughs> Hooray! You won a dragonfly for defeating the time trial. <laughs> she didn't say what it was! I don't want to challenge anything anymore. Alright. So anyways, that does it for this part. In the next part, I think I'll finish off Dragon um, Dragonfly Dojo. So, I wish you guys all a happy uh, day, evening, morning, whatever it is. And uh, have fun with life. See you guys soon.